An online petition asking that travel to Vancouver Island be restricted now has over 30,000 signatures. Greg Harper is live at the Tawasin Ferry Terminal with more on this this morning. And Greg, despite warnings from public health officials, according to social media, a lot of people were still not getting the message this weekend. Yeah, that's right. Good morning, Mary. Uh, not quite as busy to start the long weekend. Likely won't be uh, today, but there still are uh, many Vancouver Island residents that feel a lot of people headed over to the island on the weekend and for recreational purposes. We're here at the terminal. You can see to my left, in my non-expert opinion, I would say this is uh, mainly essential travel here with a number of trucks and trailers looking like they might be heading to a lot on the island. Ferry traffic is down significantly. According to BC Ferries, the number of passengers has dropped by nearly 80%. The number of sailings have gone down as well. However, there are many island residents that claim there was a surge of long weekend travelers, the feeling that many were traveling for recreational purposes. Now, an online petition asking that access to Vancouver Island be restricted. I, I checked it out uh, around 5 o'clock this morning. There was over 33,000 signatures. Now it's getting close to 35,000 just uh, in the, the couple hours uh, that I've been looking at it uh, this morning. Um, and this uh, petition is, is signed by people that, that want uh, island traffic just to be for uh, essential travelers only. Now, on the weekend, Dr. Bonnie Henry said reports of overcrowding on BC ferries were overblown, uh, saying she has uh, talked to BC ferries and the ferry company has indicated uh, the numbers are down. Now, government officials continue to ask that all British Columbians avoid non essential travel. BC Ferries saying uh, it is only going by the honor system here. The ferry company actually doesn't have the authority to restrict non-essential travel. That order has to come from the government. So it's a beautiful day here at the Tawasin Ferry Terminal. Normally would be a very busy day at being Easter Monday, but it likely uh, won't be the case here. At least it shouldn't be. Mary, over to you. Okay, thank you so much, Greg. That is our Greg Harper reporting at the Tawasin Ferry Terminal. Well, here